That's how you feeling tonight? Such a huge event, uh, Larry put on. What does this mean to the city of New Orleans, in your opinion? I mean, it's, it's I feel great. I feel, I'm blessed, bro. You know what I'm saying? Larry, that's my brother. To the end, man, we support each other. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying we just feed off each other, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm here to celebrate my boy's birthday, man. So, I mean, shout out to my brother, man. I love him to death. For $44 an hour, you coward, they use you because it's self fake. Let the people know how you feel tonight and uh, just being out here showing support for Larry. Look, man, Larry's bringing everybody out. He's bringing out the best in New Orleans. Got my brother Greg, Mr. We Dad with, with me tonight. Yo, man, happy birthday, Larry. He like lighting it up. He's setting the city on fire. He, I mean, just look out here tonight. Everybody's gonna celebrate him. He's winning. He's setting an example for other black CEOs, black entrepreneurs, yeah, and yeah. young black kids here. So, yo, man, shout out, Larry. Keep doing what you're doing, bro. We all proud of you. Big night for the city, you know what I'm saying? You know, shout out to Larry Moreau, you know, shout out to my partner Jimmy, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to the whole We That family, shout out to Ray and that we doing the move. This that Larry that put on, man, what does this mean for the city of New Orleans? Oh man, this about to be major. My man Larry been doing big things lately. He about to bring out Meek Mill, he got Fab as usual, Angela Yee. It's going crazy tonight, man. Shout out to my bro Larry. Real bro. shit, Larry, Larry my dog. He's Yayo the drummer, the one man bang, you know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah. Listen, it ain't about who did it first, it's about who did it best. And everybody know, Larry my old bitch, off the chain. The OVO way, you dig? Shout out to my man OVO. YM in the building, you know what I'm saying? We yeah, yeah. I'm a yeah, support every building. time. Yeah, yeah. Shout Appreciate you. You know what I'm saying? My half of life. Yeah. Appreciate it. Big thing going on. Larry, we see you, bro. All right. You travel a lot. You be all over the place, man. Can you let people know what a night like this means to New Orleans that Larry to put on? Um, this is probably one of the biggest nights. Well, to start off the year, then, you know, followed by Mardi Gras. Yeah. And all the rest of the holiday, you know, uh, Essence. It's kind of one of those, you know, pivotal eight, you know, times. And when I be through that party, you know, one thing for sure that it's going to be a good time. It's like an Essence weekend or something like that. You understand? Right, right, right. Well, look, I'm going to let you get inside, man. Hopefully, I'll catch you another time to do another interview. Ah, uh, Yo, man, I appreciate you. Made it in the hood. You understand? Me for yeah, life. definitely. Seven one. And it's been from uptown, I bought a of us down <laughs> Yeah, oh, then I keep Now make told that to my chain and loco In the kitchen, whipping that dope up, you can smell a odor Pug on pitching, we gon' hit it like we Sammy Sosa Put that Billy to the limit, you can smell a odor Ho, oh, spinning bitches call me chulo When I'm pulling up in that two-door Got these different color, oh no, all these honey Show me mommy, made my pocket look like Saying the event like this that, that your partner Larry putting on, what does this mean to the city of New Orleans and our nightlife, man? Man, I don't know, Larry is the goat. He, he, put, he put one out every year. He come, come with something different. He leveling up. He's been doing it for a few years now. You know what I mean? So ain't nobody gonna really do it better than Larry. Man. You know what I mean? He, he, he got it down pack right now. What a night like tonight means uh, to the city with yourself being a promoter. You know all the hard work and everything it takes going into an event like this. Well, for an event like this, it takes a lot of hard work. So I, I respect Larry a lot for being able to pull something like this off. Because in a city like New Orleans, you would think that you would get a lot of big name artists down here. But we got Meek Mill, we got Fabulous, and he's putting, he's bringing LA to the city. It's pretty much what it feels like, you know. It gives us Hollywood vibes that we don't usually get out here. Importance of a night like this here in the city. It's one of the events you don't miss. You come out, Larry show a lot of love to everybody in the city. It's one of the events you don't miss. Come out, show them love, turn up for the birthday. You gotta wear your best. All black. <laughs> yeah, so tell us a little bit about what you wearing, the NRNG. What's up with that, man? No race, no gender. Yeah. I'll tell you, hottest thing on the market. Catch up. And uh, so, what is a night like this, um, you know, being a person who traveled and seen all type of things, what does a night like this mean to the Nuance nightlife that you're putting on? This is huge. I mean, I was born and raised here, and you never see anything this big since I've grown up here. So this is a big deal. And you know what you think this this means for the city, you know, uh, what Larry put together? I mean, um, every, 
anything like this is good for the culture of New Orleans. You know, we don't have much going on. I appreciate Larry and um, everybody that's coming through, you know, and represent for the city. This huge event that Larry putting on for his birthday. Most stuff, man. This is the third time Larry has put this event on. Um, and each time it's gotten bigger and bigger. Um, you know, this time he brought out the dude Meek Mills. Um, and it's like, you know, he see he brought the whole city out. This is like a breaking, breaking records tonight. So it means a lot to the city. It's lit. Tell me how you feel it. Oh, we got the gang with the whole gang here. Yeah, we about to come beat this party up. I don't want crazy because I don't know if I can tell. We about to, we about to fuck this party up. Yeah. Listen, we, we in the group text, we said, everybody bring buku money because we about to fuck this party up. Yeah. Ain't nobody said she's going to be loud like I was here. Who? I had the biggest, I had the biggest comeback of 2019. <laughs> Drake! <laughs> Drake!